Edge and dropped by Nzema Mulhak. Great delivery from Shweb after that ball was travelling. Well, a tail there and gone. What a breakthrough, what a delivery. Shabir got it right in the end and what a batsman to have. Sachin Tendulkar is walking away from the crease, a faint edge. Gone to this is four buys. That's got away. That'll run away to the boundary. Well struck by Varinda Sevak. A little bit of width, and get, that gets the Indian supporters on the feet. Oh, good shot. No mid-off, that ball will win the race from Abdul Razak. It's the first real delivery over-pitched. And let's have a look how over-pitched it was. I think Sawag planted his front foot and waited for it to come on, trusting this pitch. Dropped again. What a miss. Pakistan extremely messy in the slip corner. This time it's Yasser Amid. And taken this time, Marinda Seva has been picked up by Shahid Afridi. He was cool as a cucumber. And a good catch in the end because. The batsman was shaping to play it across the line towards mid-wicket. Thick edge. India loses their second wicket. I don't think it's carried. It's gone for four. That's for sure. Applause from the bowler. Attempt at the attempt, I presume. Did that carry or not? I don't think it did. Well, he's already dropped one today. Yes, sir, me. Let's have a look. Well, it's pretty hard to tell from there, but... Well, he is bowling that quick. Here is a good angle. Oh, he got a hand on it. A real toughie. They've dropped three. Now, Hinzeman has been slated in the first game for bowling. First, if they bowled like this, they would have been in a lot better position. A little bit of swing. That's what's worrying the batsman, Robin, is the swing. Oh, that was a hard one for him. Oh, it's hit him in the thumb. That could bust a thumb, that. What a delivery. We talked about the way he swung the ball away. He's nipped one back earlier, and now he's done it again. He's done him all ends up, Laxman. He just can't believe. He couldn't line him up. He didn't have any confidence in knowing where the ball's going. And he might be bowling a lot of no balls and wides, but he's doing his job for his country. Make that three batsmen. Look at those bales fly. Cut away through the covers, runs for India. Four of them. Again, the fact that he's hit that in front of square indicates the ball hasn't arrived the way that he would like it to have done. Uh, and just falling short, whether there was some pad on the way that uh, got the ball to just die on the slip. We'll find out another good delivery from a Pakistani seamer. Can still score runs quickly, just like that. That's another four, the second of the over. It was in the air, but it was like lightning. Quickly to the advertising hoarding that ball traveled. 77 for three. Dravid gets another boundary. This is a very good patch for India. The last 20 minutes or so have been very good for the batting side. 
Uh, he's in just a gorgeous mood at the moment. This is great to watch. The ball has generally dominated the bat until the last 15, 20 minutes or so. There's some signs here that Yang Duli is starting to adjust to uh, batting a bit lower in the order. It even looks like he's starting to quite enjoy it out there. That's gone. That's it. Sarav Ganguly is now almost meddling everything, and that was, was certainly meddled. What a shot. Oh, no slip in place. That ball has been Great. stopped brilliantly by Abdul Raza. Great piece of fielding. Good shot, lovely shot. Raul Dravid has played an exquisite on drive. Beautiful adjustment from uh, the batsman here. Schwab had earlier beaten him, beaten him outside that off stump. He was waiting for this little bit of in swing, waited for it, and then bang, just pure timing. Edge and taken by Moin Khan. Just a tentative portion. Abdul Razak is delighted, he's picked up his. First wicket of the series, and they're all on their feet. Tremendous breakthrough. Gone through the slips and gone for four. Trevor will not chase that one. Off the back foot, that's a smashing drive. That'll go to the boundary. More width this time from Abdul Razak and picked. Bad length from him. He's been push pushing the ball, looking to pitch it up. This one was under pitched. Well, outside Ganguly's hook shot for six. This is the best shot of the match for me. Beautiful shot. Had all the time in the world, didn't he? Just opened the blade up, just on impact to find the gap there. Fant there look at this. Just a class act. He really is. He enjoyed that. Now, that's a, a shot that will get him going. Inside edge, very lucky. Yovrat Singh will pick up four. That's gone all the way. It's a quick outfield. Good stroke. Will it beat mid off? Yes, it will. And he immediately gives it up. Beautiful, beautiful stroke. It dipped all the way down, round about the 16th over. Then there was a little lift to the 20th, and then. Everything evened out again, he's still going for the sweep shot, and it's got him out. Good, good wicket-keeping. Second chance for Mohan Khan, but he took it. And the stroke that Ian Healy's just been discussing is the downfall of Raul Dravid. Well, he's gone such a long way across his crease in the quest for a single. There's three men protecting the boundary for this shot. Roald Dravid wants it, goes right across, it bounces, it takes something. Glove, was it? Bat. Malik knows what it was, he slowed the ball down, looped it up, made Dravid wait for it, and now he can sit in the pavilion and watch the rest of the innings. Five for 139. the latter right in front of everything Whoa. second ball we've seen everyone struggle early except the two men that are in right at the moment Yuvra Singh and Ramesh Power oh dismissed with arrogance almost He's not going to muck around with anything short. Don't care how sharp it is. He was onto it. He committed to the front foot and then just stood tall and smacked in front of square. Gone through the slip court and they'll run away to the boundary very quickly. Sami is frustrated. 166 for six.
Appeal from Shev Malik, upheld by the umpire. Tawar looking for that strong sweep. Shev Malik hitting the pad. Interesting decision. Well, that's gone. That's gone. That's a lovely shot into the crowd. A good goal by Irfan Patan. Well, Shoaib Malik just tossing it up. He's had a good spell. The batsmen are on the defensive, considering the wickets lost. So he just tossed this one up. And that's a great cricketing shot. <laughs> Nicely placed into the gap by Yuvraj. It's 190 for seven. Oh, he's found one down a third man. A little bit fortunate, but he'll take it. It's 198 for seven. Oh, beautifully bowled. Show back there. On takeoff. Once again, he's knocked the stump right out of the ground. They can't get to that one. Just a thick enough edge from Balaji to get it away to the boundary. Well, that's a glorious shot. That's not the shot of a number 10. That's a good shot. I just looking at that on drive that um, and there's the 50 to uh, your grudge oh what a shot that's way back into the crowd into the press box that's destroyed a bit of copy well don't worry about 30. He's got his eyes on a few more, maybe get to 250. But we've seen along the ground, wide of mid on. Now in the air, out of the playing arena. Oh, another six. What a good shot. I bet that's what uh, Pakistan, in fact, it has bounced just inside the rope. I bet that's what Pakistan is saying at the moment. Not a number 10 who can bat. Oh, lovely shot. And it's gone for six. He got it over the head of fine leg, and it's gone so quickly it's cleared the rope. Well, that's beautifully struck into the gap. Be interested to read Mohammed Sami's mind right now. Was he trying to get him out, or was he trying to create or stop runs? Because the other night, when he was bowling to win a match, he got the Yorker perfect. Today, when they're looking to keep the total down, he's bowled in the half volley slot. Mid wicket is there. And well taken. Now that was the man who was just pushed back. In fact, he's the man who's uh, skippering the side at the moment, Yusuf Johanna. Beautifully into the gap. Very handy boundary. And that's it. 244 India Post from their 50 overs. A chase of 245 for Inzaman. Going by what he said at the toss. He should be reasonably happy with that because he said he'd like to chase uh, no more than 250. When? Oh, four beautiful runs. Swung in to the perfect spot to pick it up from. Good shot. And he needed one hand to play with.
Freedy on strike. Well in. Off stump out of the ground, looking to hit it over mid wicket. And a very important, very important early breakthrough. Oh, good shot for. Beautifully across and into position to play the ball. Doesn't he like hitting them through point? He's already hit one drive for four in the previous over. He hit one there with uh, that was with one hand. He hit another one through for a couple, and that is just smashed. Oh, that doesn't give him any confidence. Nothing will. Look at that for balance. Ah, this is a good battle between two youngsters. Shazam. for four but it, then again it might and does got a big hand on it at extra cover there but couldn't slow it down enough out caught second slip he takes his second wicket DBS Laxman the catcher and India needed that they needed it very badly they just took the man away from there. Then Gurley won't be happy with that. Well, that's a grand shot. Beautiful square drive. Well, those two shots might get him back into form in a hurry. Well, three fours. That's good batting. Beautifully struck now. The bowler's saying that he touched it and the umpire agrees with him. And the batsman absolutely no chance at the bowler's end. So Yunus Khan, who was just starting to hit the ball beautifully, has been run out at the non-striker's end. Big shout there from Balji. He was pretty convinced. He did eventually look around at the umpire, but he might be in a bit of trouble for that. Gone to beautiful placement from Yasser Hamid. He's buried very nicely. Another four. There he goes this time to square leg. A good runs. Diving effort from Balaji. He's enjoying himself. He's had a good game. Agent taken. Lovely delivery by Zahifa. Shweb Malik was struggling that line from Zahir and is Verinda Sevak who has picked up a beauty. She had carried clearly and easily to Sewak. It was on the way up to him. He's taken it really well. But he did bang it in Zahir. Found the link. Had the batsman squaring up. Jumping at the crease. Outside edge to Sewak. Slip was uh, not in the conventional position. Had Sevak been in the first slip position, that would have been an easy catch for him. Oh, lovely shot once again, punching the ball hard of the back foot. Mohamed Kaf, he will not be able to stop that one. Just a long slip by that edge has uh, found the boundary. Once again, nice flick off the pad. Balaji is struggling to get that one under control. That's uh, won the race. That ball has won the race from Balaji. Another four. Yasser Amid, 48 now. That's his 50. The crowd erupts. They're all on the gallery to applaud his fine effort. Struck away, that'll go for four. What a good stroke. Stood up straight and just swatted it away. Ah! 
Ooh, and that's beaten him just to his right. Raced away for four. It was in the air for a moment or two. I'm not sure that he didn't get just a fingernail on it. Nevertheless, it's four valuable runs. Another run in an area where he has scored a heavy amount today. There have been lots of runs scored in that area square on the offside. Here's four more. I don't think this is good bowling or good thinking on the part of India. And another one. How beautifully struck was that. So poised. So balanced. Oh. That's four more. Exquisite timing. That's all you can say. He hasn't lashed at that at all. He's just let the ball arrive. Knocked it back past him. Four to Pakistan, but it's paid. Oh, beautiful placement. Gave mid on no chance at all. Now, Hamid is getting strong on the onside. Now, he just sees the ball change up delivery and hits a wider mid on. Now, he is starting to get into the groove and being dangerous on both sides of the pitch now. Oh, he's got that one fine. That's very delicate. A touch of class, really is a touch of class for this fella. 14 boundaries, he's raced us to 87 now. See you later, that's in the stands. What a powerful man. Not by Shepard there, just motioning to the fieldsman it's it's gone over the roof huge hit made his mind up come down the pitch toss it up and i'll toss it back at you up up and right out of there that went right up into the radio commentary box he knows he's got that right in the middle what a huge hit great player against great player here oh that's got to be close the wrong one, yes, he's given him. Beautifully bowled, Sachin Tendulkar. And Inzamam not picking the wrong one again. Clever shot. That'll go for four. Well, mistake not, Rami, that is Pakistan's game at the moment. All you can perhaps uh, say is that India can still come back. But it is very much Pakistan's game. Beautifully played. It wasn't that far down on the leg side just about middle stump that's gone caught slow one from Irfan Patan has done the job it's Yovrat Singh who's got him out caught at point and there's a complete silence in the stadium here Pakistan lose their most crucial wicket of the innings I just wonder why this could not have been done earlier by the Indian bowlers. They fed him in that area with seam up deliveries. Irfan Patan, great thinking there, slow delivery, getting the batsman to drive. And again, the length is the key with Irfan Patan. Oh, that's gone through. That'll be four. Moin Khan didn't look elegant, but it didn't matter in the end. Luring him into drive and, well, finding the gap square this time on the offside. Pawar, well, does well, but I think that's gone. They'll be referred to the third umpire, but I'm sure that it has uh, hit the skirting. Tendulkar drops him. Mind you, it was a hot one. Exactly the same shot as the one that hit Mohan Khan's bat. This time, Tendulkar gets in the way. Smacked straight back into his midriff. Well, that one will beat Ganguly. 
A handy boundary. That's where he likes to go straight. He's just cleared Tendulkar. Oh, and by the way, I can introduce you to a bloke who'll spell underhand for you. Long chase, and he's not going to get there, Sabak. Razak, once again, he's doing the job for Pakistan. Well, that's four. He really is a hard man to stop, Razak. And he's cleared the uh, outfielder. There's a slower ball. Razak, what he does, he, he clears that front foot. But he does that early, but he keeps his hands back. That's what allows him to play shots like this off slower balls. Jarvid Mundad doesn't know whether to applaud or out on him. He said no big shots, hit the singles. He's quiet in the dressing room at the moment. Well, he can win the game and bring up his 50 here. Oh, and what a magnificent way to finish it. That's 50 for Abdur Razak, and a courageous 50 in the circumstances, and he's won the game for Pakistan. Not quite the thriller of game one and two, but certainly ebbed and flowed, chopped and changed throughout the day. The way India fought back with the bat after Pakistan struck so early with hostility and fire. They used the conditions in Zamam al Haq decided to bowl first on. The crowd on many occasions throughout the day have gone quiet. Then they've pumped up and that's how they finished the day. Ganguly not happy. Abdul Razak.